Testing, testing, one, two, DreAllDay.com. What's up, everybody? This is Dre Baldwin coming to you. We get into this week's motivation. This week's motivation is very simple. It's called Be You. And why I say that motivation this week is Be You is because in this game, in this game of basketball, there's a lot of players that come up, you know, they're looking for something to model their game after or some ideal to aim for as far as their basketball skills go. So they... You know, you want to be Derrick Rose or, you know, back when I was a teenager, it was everybody wanted to be Allen Iverson or Kobe or Penny Hardaway. And then it became, now is everybody want to be Derrick Rose or Kyrie Irving or, you know, Stephen Curry or whoever had a good game last night or whatever. You can do, as far as developing your game or whatever field you in, it don't have to be basketball. You could have whatever field you in. If you're a lawyer, it's probably lawyers that you look up to or whatever. You can take elements from other people's abilities, from other people's skills, from the things that other people do, their performance. You can take elements, and you have to, what you have to do with those elements is apply them to your situation, your reality. You can't be that other person. Like I've seen, when I was 14, Allen Iverson came to the NBA, and he was doing a crossover, and everybody wanted to do the crossover. Everybody wanted to be Iverson. And it's been 17 years since then, and I ain't seen not one Allen Iverson clone yet, not one. And all of us was trying to be Iverson. Nobody did it. Nobody succeeded in being Iverson. So all the players coming up now, you want to be Rose or Irving or Curry, you're not going to succeed in being that guy. But what you can do is take elements, elements from those guys that can work for you and apply them to your reality in that way. You can be you, you can do what they're doing and take some things that they do well, but do it in your own way, in a way that applies to your reality. If you ain't got the quickness or the size or the athleticism of a player that you're trying to be like, then you're going to fail in trying to imitate that person. And even if you do have it, your situation is never going to be exactly like theirs, so you can't be that person. You can't be your dad, and it's not about a famous person. Like, uh, that's why I just said it there. It's not about them being famous. Like some people may think if I say, oh, you want to be Derrick Rose, good luck. You're not going to be Derrick Rose. They think it's because I'm saying because Derrick Rose is famous or because he's so good that I'm saying that they can't be good. That's not what I'm saying. You can be good in your way. You can't be another person. You can't be your dad. You can't be your sister. You can't be the dude up the street at the block. You can't be the dude at the wreck. You can't be the personal trainer at the gym. You can't be the woman on the cover of the magazine. You can't be that guy with the YouTube video. You got to be you. You got to do what you do as best as you can do it. You're not going to be Derrick Rose. You're never going to be Derrick Rose. You're never going to be that player at the playground around the corner. Whatever your name is right now, say your name, your full name, first name, last name. My name's Dre Baldwin. Whatever your name is, say your name. You stuck being that person forever. For the rest of your life, the only person you can ever be is that person. So the first step in getting to being the best you, like the super you that I talked about many weeks ago in Weekly Motivation, you look in the Motivation playlist, you'll see it. The first step in getting to becoming the best you is that you got to embrace the fact that you are who you are. You got to embrace your reality. Your reality is your fill in the blank, whatever your name is. You are that person. You always been and you always will be. As soon as you embrace that and you start to feel like it's cool to be that, then maybe you'll get to the point one day when other people are looking at you and saying, damn, I need to take some elements from that person and apply them to my life. So instead of you looking at a Derrick Rose and saying, damn, I want to be like Derrick Rose, maybe some kid 20 years from now will be looking up to you and saying, damn, I want to be that guy, whatever your name is, or that girl, whatever she is. And this don't have to be basketball. This could be anything. You could be an actor. You could be a teacher. You could be a, a police officer. You could be a doctor. You could be whatever you want to be. You got to embrace being you. Make that cool. Reach the highest level of you. And then maybe other people will want to take elements from what you do. And then you could tell them the same thing I'm telling you. Be you. Do it as best as you can. Take elements from other people that work. Apply them to your reality. You're not going to be exactly like them. And see where it takes you. Work on your game. DreAllDay.com Yo, this is Matt from the UK. Work on your game.